you know, three straight wins. We're, we're, we're feeling real good right now. And it's just due to the practices and everything that we've been doing. We've just been going out there real focused and every, with everything that we do. And that's, that's how we've been getting the wins. Just, you, can't, you, got, you can't look back in the past and you can't look forward. You just got to look, you know, at the day that you get. And every single day that you get attack that day and win that day. And that's what we do. After, after the start that you guys got off to, dropping your first two, it would have been easy for you know guys to kind of hang their heads and for that to maybe kind of snowball a little bit. How were you guys able to to really stay locked in the way that you did? Well, we knew it was a long season ahead, and I mean, just you know, with everything that we had, we haven't even played a conference game yet before we had those two losses. So, coming into conference play versus Walford, we just knew we had to you know start getting. So to start practicing the same way that we were practicing and just keep on doing what we were doing because we knew what the stuff that we were doing was good. So just coming into that and that's how we were able to, you know, continue the win streak that we had. Uh, got another big one in your house. Yes, this sir. Week. Um, what would a win over Furman mean to you guys? A uh, win over Furman, I mean, you know, that's obviously, I know y'all know it's for first place right now in the conference. And I mean, that would just, you know, keep us on the same track that we've been doing. I mean, we, we like we said, we can't look back in the past, but we just got to keep moving forward with everything and attack each day. So, I mean, Saturday's going to be no different. Nick, you guys have kind of gotten the run game going the, these last couple of weeks, and obviously that starts up front, but Jay's got it going on. Chris has played well, I would imagine. You, you take a lot of pride in, in yes, the sir. run game the last couple of weeks. Yes, sir, most definitely. I mean, I know all of us, I mean, all the O-linemen, we, we take pride in that. You know, we want to run the ball. We don't want to be one-dimensional versus teams. We want teams to, you know, respect our run game and everything like that. So in order to do that, that's why we go out there and practice the way that we do. We practice hard every single day. And I know that's why all the O-linemen appreciate that, so. Uh, AJ Tony made a big play for you guys down the, down the stretch of the last one. Is, was he a guy that, that you expected to see big things out of this season? Coming in, I know he had a whole bunch of, you know, buzz around him, you know, just coming in, like Coach Hatcher said, with recruiting and everything. But, I mean, like, you know, we have that next man up mentality, so everybody has to be ready no matter what's going on. And that's why he was ready whenever his number was called. And that's why he was able to do the things that he did. So.